Is this really noticeable? It's driving me crazy. <coughs> Ew. Just shows you how not perfect I am. What's up? Happy end of 2021 and welcome to the beginning of 2022. My last vlog for the end of 2021. So thank you for past year and the start of 2022, which isn't here yet, but it will be here before you know it. And uh, yes, so many exciting things happening in 2022. So hopefully we'll be good. It's the most wonderful time of the year. The one that my family has been waiting so long for. Another closet clean out. I feel like just yesterday I was doing my closet clean out, but at the same time, I don't remember anything. So that's fantastic. Um, we got COVID, we didn't get COVID yet. Uh, so we're all going to get tested today. We got COVID last Christmas too, so I don't know if you guys remember that, but. But stuff. Uh, closet clean out is happening today. And so I'm gonna flip the camera around to show you what our first thing is that we're getting rid of. The thing that I'm getting rid of is somewhere on my body. It's not my Restless Heart, honey. If you guys have been following me, you know how, what a big fan of Restless Heart I am. It's from one of the young adult leaders for the diocese. Okay, I just wanted to put it on like a tuck in or a t-shirt. Cause like, look at these pants. I tend to work out a lot in pajamas. And so these just never really worked. And then especially if you're filming your workouts, they never have really fit right. I got it for Christmas one year and I both kind of like altered them. So that they would stay up, but then they just like broke. So I think I'm gonna get rid of these. They're so cute though. Like I love the plaid and it's kind of like distressed right here. Yeah, it's time to get rid of these guys. Plus I've had them for so long. I think I just need to update all of my pajama pants anyway. Now that I just cleaned the mirror a little bit for you, the next thing I'm gonna get rid of is this. I'm sorry, cat. It's actually very cute. I love the style of it, but like, it's kind of low. Kind of like this is weird. It's actually like really short and it tends to just, just like ride up. I don't know. I'm kind of just feeling it's cute. I don't know. I think I'm going to get rid of it. I do wear a lot of stuff that Kat tends to give me. I'm going to voice over right here and show you some of the pictures that she's taken of me in clothes that he's got to me, but yeah. This is probably going, I don't know, should it? I feel like it just doesn't really fit right. Also, just wanted to say, my 100th video, I'm like so close to 100 videos, but I just had to back my big 100 video event. And so, to February 9th. So, Day two. Next thing that I'm gonna get rid of are these jeans. Um, I'm about to make a reel um, and I'll be wearing these jeans and I also wore them um, when I announced that, I'm turning the flash on, um, when I announced that I was reading The Violent Buried Away by Flannery O'Connor, which is such a banger that we can sing, they call me tar water. I was also wearing these jeans because they're my only non-ripped jeans that I have I wore that um but yeah these like they I need to work out my core do a Joel Freeman but they like don't zip up properly and they're like such a weird fit um, how is this Christmas never mind I have to leave for work in less than an hour but the next thing I'm getting rid of is this little um American flag she's like I think that's like mascara or sharpie or what is that this is why we're getting rid of it um, one summer we went to a whole bunch of my siblings volleyball games and I bought a whole bunch of patriotic stuff because one of my friends was like I love all of your patriotic gear so I like purposely went out and made sure I had a different patriotic gear for every single game look at this mess you know my sister's home when art starts happening I cannot get the lighting right in this room. Okay, I've been really motivated to finish my closet clean out, um, but we're gonna try to finish it. I need to get a haircut. This thing is a mess. The, uh, my haircut vlog is gonna be my 
end of the video. So I'm getting rid of this shirt. Um, this is where I used to work I'm at a little pool. Does it say pool right there? Boom. But they haven't been open for two years because of what's going on in the world right now and trying to be safe and keep everybody healthy. And the girl that used to be the manager who I like love, like she was, like she's so nice and she has the cutest kids and she's just amazing and she's so chill and like amazing. Um, she doesn't even work there anymore and like I don't know. If I go back, I have like three of these, let's just say. I don't need three of them. Like who knows if I'm even gonna go back. So I'm gonna keep one just for keepsake and I'm gonna get rid of all of the other ones. So I'm gonna get rid of this t-shirt. We have another work t-shirt that we're getting rid of uh, and I still have one more. So I told you that we had a lot. Um, I think I've worked at this place for five years, five summers in a row. Um, and then COVID, I uh, had to stop my streak. And my sisters worked there a year or two. So we have a lot, we have one more. So I had like three. Um, probably can find more, maybe, um, or we threw them all out, but I'm gonna get rid of this. I really need to go get ready for church, and I keep getting so distracted of stuff that I have to do. But I'm getting rid of this shirt today. Collar is kind of frayed, which I can show you when I get better lighting. I think I got this, like, from my cousin, Stu Ert, because he gave it to my brother, and then I just, like, stole it. Okay, that's it. Gotta go get ready for church now. All right, I really have to work out because I really need to get this closet clean out done. I wanted to show you what one of our last pieces is that we're getting rid of. I don't have that many clothes, but everybody says I do. So we have this now like little like closet thing in our basement and I'm gonna show you. So this is because our closet doesn't have enough space. So this is great because it's all just my summer clothes. Wait, let me get it started. This sweater and then this little blue dress is what I wore when I went to the theology on uh tap finale. Or uh, yeah, finale. And this one is all ten dollar. For the very first time. Well not for the very first time. I met Dominic, but that's when I saw him a dollar for four. Next thing we get rid of is this um like little skirt maxi skirt i've had it for so long and i've wanted to get rid of it for like the past year or two but i like haven't we're getting rid of it now so i've like worn it the past two summers just because i knew that i wanted to try to like get rid of it and i also wore it in the intro of my 2021 soap haul so we're gonna get rid of it and i've had it forever it might be in like some of my instagram stuff because I've probably worn it in YouTube stuff so we're getting rid of this and I will show you a little up close and personal after I work out. I literally have to leave so soon um but I'm getting rid of these American flag flip-flops. These shoes saved my life and I had my swollen foot. That vlog will also be up. Um my friend Emily when she would play volleyball I would always go watch her outside. I, one season, I like wore something patriotic every single time. And so that's what these are. You have not even seen me with my new hair that I just got done. That vlog will be, I think it's right here. I don't know how to do this anymore. Um, but we are going to go drop off this bag. It's about a Walmart like plastic grocery bag size full of stuff that you guys have seen before this. Um, so we're gonna go drop that off and then we're gonna go home and I'm gonna try to do a little reaction for my family and see what they think. It's just my mom and my brother home right now, so... And I'm also still hungry! I was just talking to my friend on the phone and he's getting Chick-fil-A and I'm so jealous! Hopefully mom has something to be at home! We had somebody here for our TV and cable box and now my mom is vacuuming. So this is perfect timing to film my outro. Because we're leaving for adoration at St. Mary's in 15 minutes. But I wanted to film the outro. My cousin just said she liked my hair and it makes me look very grown up. <laughs> Thanks. Um, so we're just going to sign it out. I don't really know what else to say. So we're just going to say, bye! You really didn't think I was going to end this vlog without saying ciao babes. Did you? Ciao babes. Also, we have to go take the thumbnail now.
I guess we'll just start off our, what's it called, KonMari closet, whatever it's called, in the end of July. We were over at some friend's house last, not last night, but the night before that, um, and I was hanging out. And we were being so loud and crazy upstairs, going in from the son's room to the girl's room and like back and forth and everything. They were like trying to show me all the stuff in their room and everything. And the seventh grader stepped on my shoe. And so, yeah, this one is the one that's not broken. You see, they're Crocs, so they should be good quality, but they kind of held, I've had these forever, so it's fine. Kind of held together by these little button things and they're like foam, rubber, whatever. So she stepped on the back of my shoe and it broke. It was just a little boy who rode by on his bicycle. It kind of broke. And then she tried to tape it back together, hence all the tape. And I was just on a walk and it broke. So that's, we're gonna have to throw these out. Um, but I'm here at the park firehouse. Um, and we had aftercare today and it was so hot outside. But I'm not complaining because I would rather have it hot than like snowing. But I didn't get my swing time in, so I think I'm just gonna hang out and swing at this little park.